What's up guys? Just wanted to bring you my really, really late March and April uh, Blu-ray update. I've been busy, been traveling. So, anyways, let's just get into this. I got a Disney 4K slips, Amorays, DVDs, whole bunch of uh, whole bunch of stuff. So, let's get into it really quick. DVD wise, got this from the dollar store. Uh, Angry Beavers um, doesn't really hold up for me. Um, doesn't at all. So, next DVD is Friends with Money. It's a Jennifer Aniston film. It's one that I don't have in my collection. It was a it was a okay okay thing. And on to one Disney title. This is when I found that it was coming out. It was a must have, which is uh, Jungle to Jungle. This one still holds up for me. Um, 4K. We are at uh, Groundhog Day. The only reason I picked it up was um, because of the fact that everyone's been saying that this slip is going to be rare. So I decided to pick it up. Amazing movie. Um, and the next 4K is. Uh, Baywatch, gotta have this, I'm a huge Baywatch fan. I got like four copies of this movie, so why not have it on 4K? Um, also came with the code, so I used it. So now I can watch this movie anywhere. But happy to have it. Um, okay, on to slips. Uh, Brawl and Cell Block 99. As you can see, it's still factory sealed, haven't watched it. Um, I heard it's a amazing movie. Next one I thought was going to be much funnier than what it than what it was. Um, I think it's better than the original. But Jumanji: Welcome to the Jungle, really good movie. Um, another one that I found for a steal. Um, Fell asleep through it, gotta rewatch it. And that's uh, Daddy's Home 2. Um, from what I remember of it, I, re I really didn't care for it. I prefer the first one. Next one is Independence Day. Classic. Next one that I got from the Dollar Tree sale. Still factory sealed, 7th door. The next one I've heard. In, uh, Nothing but good things about. And that's the Iceman. Um, this one is uh, a really good film. It's based on history. Um, I had to pull a slippity, but it's Parkland. And then the next two, um, I'm really happy to have because this completes my collection of slip covers. First one is. Tokyo Drift. And the other one is Fast and Furious. Moving along to Jennifer Aniston stuff. Um, haven't seen this one yet. She's funny that way. Haven't seen it. Uh, this one I've been wanting to see. I missed it at the Dollar Tree sale, but I ended up picking it up and then getting the slip off of uh, Chad Arms cake. Uh, this is one I definitely been wanting to see. I can tell it's more of a, a drama. Um, next one I got to slip off of Chad, uh, but it's um, it wasn't it wasn't a really good movie. I mean, it was an okay movie. It wasn't Jennifer Aniston's best, but it does have uh, Tim Robbins in it, so I figured I'd pick it up. But Life of Crime wasn't a really good movie. Next one I haven't seen is uh, Love Happens. Um, yeah. Uh, this one I got off of WrestleManiac 1130. Haven't seen it in years. From what I remember, it was okay. Because um, I'm not a not a big fan of Ben Stiller, but it's a long game, Polly. 
And the next one, which was an excellent one, is he's just not that into you. So. Yeah, moving along to the Emery. <clears throat> this is a DVD upgrade. The Days of Thunder. Really good movie. Uh, this next one is is a must-have for me. Still holds up, but it's, it's just really cheesy. And that's Jingle All the Way with uh, Schwarzenegger and Sinbad. My number one favorite Christmas movie. Um, even more so than Home Alone. Uh, next one I haven't seen in a while, but it's a classic. My cousin Vinny. Um, I seen that they had a Deadpool slipcover for it, but to tell you the truth, I'm not a big fan of um, them Deadpool slipcovers at all. At all. Next one I haven't seen is New Year's Eve. Um, next one I'm a big Tom Hanks fan and also Sandra Bullock. Which is extremely loud and incredibly close. Heard, heard nothing but good things about. Her next three is uh, dollar store pickups, dollar tree pickups. This one I, I looked at the trailer I thought it was pretty good. So, it's Nicolas Cage stolen. It's a hit or miss. Nicolas Cage is always a hit or miss with me. Um, next one I is the family heard nothing but good things about. Um, next one after that, haven't seen. Big fan of the cast. Uh, Michael Caine and Kate Beckinsale, which is Stonehurst Asylum. Uh, my buddy watched this and. Uh, that was pretty good. Next two were uh, amazing movies. First one is uh, Collateral Beauty. The ending is, is very shocking. I did not think um, they were going to have that type of ending. And also Sleeping with Other People. Um, because of this movie, I'm actually starting to get into Jason Sudeikis. Next one is Swelter. Um, it was an okay movie. Not a big uh, fan of John Claude Van Damme. Um, next one, thanks to Ashley from uh, Talk Movies with us. She uh, gave everyone the heads up in her group about this and many more movies. Um, I think it was like five bucks with the Revenant. Um, one of my favorite Stephen King movies of all time, Shawshank Redemption. One of my favorite uh, movies, at least in the series, is uh, The Marine. I think I picked this up at Big Lots for three bucks. I don't know, maybe it was five. And then, following suit, The Marine 2. Next one was a okay movie, Extract. I would give it a recommend. Also, Nature Calls. It was it was better than I expected. Um, most of these titles are all were all a dollar. Uh, the next one is from eBay. My favorite movie of all time, um, or one of my favorite movies of all time. Uh, Patrick Swayze stars in this, and that's Black Dog. Alright, two more stacks. Yeah. Next one, um, I'm starting to get into Milo, Mila Kunis and Justin Timberlake was, uh, was a really good actor. Friends with Benefits. A little bit too much, um, me personally, a little bit too much sex for me. Um, big fan of Vin Diesel. Um, one of my favorites is Knock Around Guys, and this is also the Canadian version, I guess, I believe so. Because um, as you can tell, right there. Um, next one, one of my favorite Denzel and Ethan Hawke films of all time, Training Day. Um, next one, 
Kevin James uh, Mall Cop. Um, one of my favorite Kevin James films. This is actually better than the second one that they made in the series. I truthfully hope that they don't uh, make another one. Uh, one of my favorite Schwarzenegger films of all time, besides Jingle All the Way, is Collateral Damage. Amazing film. Um, one that I had mixed reviews about, but Melissa McCarthy steals the show for me in this, which is um, Buddy Cop film Heat. Um, Melissa McCarthy is definitely a bad cop in this, truthfully. Another Nicolas Cage film, Trespass. Um, I believe this is a home invasion, so um, yeah, should be a good film. Next one, I completely forgot about this, but I got this at the dollar store, and I was like, dude, I had to pick this up. Uh, you know, I'm a big fan of Jerry Pickett Smith and Adam Sandler, um, which is rain over me. It was a dollar. Couldn't, couldn't beat it. Um, another one, I've seen the first one. I haven't seen the second one, but Killing Season and Red Lights. Dollar store, pick up. Um, Killies, Killing Season was, was a really good movie. Um, the ending surprise. Uh, Surprised me. Didn't think it was gonna go down like that. So I'll give that a watch if I were you. Last stack. Uh, big fan of uh, Sarah Jessica Parker. So it's uh, Meet the Morgans. Or did you hear about the Morgans? Uh, sorry. Did you hear about the Morgans? Funny film. Definitely very heartfelt. Uh, another one that's that was pretty good. A lot of good. Uh, mm. A lot of good actors in here. Tower Heist. This next one, I. This next. Uh, la, la, la. This next one had really good actors, but the thing is, is it wasn't a really good movie. It was Kevin James' least, uh, one of my least favorite movies. Um, here comes the boom. Uh, this one looks really interesting. Haven't seen it. Definitely want to. Six Souls with uh, Julianne Moore. Um, I'm not a big fan of Woody Harrelson, but it has a strong cast and for a buck. Um, Rampart. Another one. Um, huge Will Smith fan. I Am Legend. I didn't really like the ending to tell you the truth. And this one is the 40th anniversary of Jesus Christ Superstar, one of my favorite musicals of all time. A lot of good music. And the last two for this update is um, Condemned. Really good movie. Um, don't remember too much about it. It was a DVD upgrade. And the next one's a DVD upgrade, which is uh, The Condemned 2. So. Um, I kind of like the them two more than the original. So, all right, guys, uh, that's all for my pickups. Sorry it was so late. Uh, stay tuned because, like I said, literally in a couple weeks I'll be doing another one. So, uh, yeah, uh, leave comments, subscribe, like the video, share it around. At 99 subs, I need one more to hit 100. So, with that said. I'll catch you guys in the next one.